Did I get the Twizzlers? Did I get them all out? So, today, art. I made it. Well, I didn't make each and every piece. I call it found functional art. So, and it took many hours. I have a whole video, a couple of videos on how I made this art. This beautiful work of art. The Great Wall of Vapes from China. They don't have tanks. They don't have any little pre-filled pot. There's no nicotine. It's a nicotine free zone over here. And I lost my train of thought. And I'm gonna sell my art. I'm gonna sell it on buysellvape.com. So they contacted me, they sponsored this video, and I'm I'm gonna post my art on buysellvape.com. And I don't want anyone to buy it. I don't actually wanna sell it. That would make me cry. I really honestly would cry at that point. So I'm gonna put some ridiculous price on it. So don't you dare, don't you dare. No one buy that. No, you're not allowed. You're not allowed to buy this. But if you do, I'll be able to pay off my kitchen. But before we start, let's play a game. Are the contents of this can for kids? Rest assured, with a label like that, you know it's safe for children. I'm just doing this as a joke. I wanna see how many people complain about the price and just, I just wanna see the reaction on this. This is gonna be hilarious. There's no way someone's gonna buy this, no way. I can't just post something without knowing the condition of it. So as I said, this is functional art, but how much of it is still functioning? Let's find out. Let's find out. Yeah. No, these are not Mickey's pants. These are my pants. I bought them from Mickey. I'm not gonna test pod kits. I think a lot of us are sick of seeing pod kits. So I'm just gonna skip those. Anything that uses an external battery, like an 18650 or bigger sizes, if I have them, then I will test it. And anything with an internal battery that's not a pod kit, I'm not gonna charge it up to see if it's working right, but I am gonna check it to see if it's still ho holding a charge because if it is, that would be pretty impressive. Considering some of these have been in, well, in their box, not on the wall, but like in their boxes since 2014. And just to make things a little more exciting, cause this could be really, really boring. I'm gonna respond to some of the comments from the previous video. It's so weird hearing someone say, my name is Sophie, other than me. Second comment from another person. It's so weird hearing someone say, it's so weird hearing someone say, my name is Sophie, other than me. It's so weird that the second person heard something in the first comment. I only saw words and I read it, but I didn't hear anything. I got this one for free. I think it was a trade. I did a trade with someone a long time ago. It needs a part. It's broken. It is not safe for use and I don't, remember these ever being, this particular model ever being that safe. Couldn't stop laughing after that burp. You'd fit right in at my work. No, I wouldn't. Don't ever say that. I am 100% unemployable. When magnets just can't touch, that's work, me, it just, it doesn't work. This is one of the neatest ones I've come across. I love that. Love the dig at the alcohol industry. Toodaloo to lee lose. I don't get it. I don't even remember. 
remember what kind of battery that was. That's huge. Oh yeah! Yeah, it still works, but look what happened to the paint. And it's like that all over the gold parts looks really nasty. And it's been kept in the same conditions as all the other devices. Ugh. Yeah, my favorite Rick and Morty mod is included. This is not a wrap. This is painted, this is custom painted. So this like $180 mod is more like a $300 mod. Who made, I don't even remember who made this. I don't remember who this is, but there's the logo and it's, it's not quality stuff. And here's my other custom painted mod. Bummer that not all the letters fit, but, but you get it. Bob Ross. And the original batteries are still in here. This is like really, really old. Sigo T50. It has an internal battery, and years later, there's still a charge. It's like half full. What? It's me. Yeah, there's there's a few of them out there with my logo or my face in them. It's weird. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, it just turned on. It just turned on. It just took. A lot of clicks. Oh master, I am your new warrior. Oh master, I am your new warrior. Hey, for all of you guys that keep asking for something more than an 18650, dual 18650, well, this one uses 2700s and it calls you master. <laughs> Holy moly, another really old one. This one's from Inakin, hasn't been charged in years, still works. There's still a charge on it. <laughs> I keep saying Inakin's like a really good one, but everyone goes out and buys smuck. All right, not everyone, but a lot of people. It's day three that I've been working on this video. The last part, I gotta list this wall. <sighs> this is kind of scary. I can't believe I'm just posting six years of vape stuff. Holy moly. I'm gonna be Zophie. Username Zophie. 
email. Sure, let's use Zofie Vapes at Yahoo. That's my old email, but I still look at it once in a while. Passwords are in. I've agreed to the terms and conditions that I have fully read. And I'm gonna now create account. Here we go, post ad, username, password, login. Oops, oh wait, I gotta check my email and verify my ad. And now I get to log in all over again. Log in, and now I can create my ad. So that's what this page is all about. Category, other, vape kits, mods? Should I put mods? There should be a category for lots. Or should I just do it as other? I'm gonna go with mods, cause I mean, it is a mod wall of art. I don't even know how many vapes are on the wall. 300, over 300, I don't know. Mod wall art by Sophie Vapes. Or Sophie Reviews. Formerly known <laughs> Sophie Vapes. I'm just gonna put mod wall art by Sophie. Over 300 mods were used to create this stunning work of art. It was carefully Constructed by Sophie Reviews, formerly Sophie Vapes. There is a video about this wall if you need more details. <laughs> I'm not even going to provide details. Painstakingly constructed. By Sophie Reviews, formerly Sophie Vapes. Condition used. Price $9,999.95. Just, there's just one, and shipping's free. Venmo, PayPal. I like USPS Priority Mail. They're the cheapest. And this is located in Florida. Oh good, there's a spot for the video URL. People are gonna be like, oh my God, I can't believe she listed it for 10,000 when she could have just given stuff to me. Well, listen, I can't give stuff away. I'm not allowed to give stuff away anymore. So, so it is what it is. It just is what it is. So I'm gonna pop some pictures on here. Buy a piece of vape history. I'm a vape reviewer. That's gonna be history very soon here. What happens if I continue? Oh. Did I post it? Did I post it? I think I posted it. <laughs> no, I haven't, okay. So the last thing I have to do is click submit post. And I'm gonna do that when the video goes up. I don't wanna push the submit button. I hope you don't buy it. But who's really got 10 grand laying around? I know, I know I don't, but if you don't, there's other things on this site. Like you can sell your vapes or you can buy other people's vapes for a lot less than $10,000. So I guess check it out. Here's some stuff. And you're gonna see my overpriced wall on here very shortly. <laughs> and that's it. Thank you to buysolvape.com and here's hoping no one buys the wall art. Toodaloo. <laughs>